Subscribe to our YouTube channel to become a part of our growing YouTube community and to learn English effectively. What does your company do exactly? We design and assemble a wide range of electric generators for hospitals, hotels, ANC small factories. We specialize in medium sized generators, but we're hoping to diversify into larger models next year. And who do you sell to? We export to Eastern Europe and the Far East. The domestic market accounts for about 40% of our total sales. Are you a goal-oriented person? Yes, I am. I always make a plan before I do anything. Where do you want to be in five years? I don't want to have a specific title. I just want to enjoy what I am doing. That sounds very reasonable. It's the most important thing to me. If you are hired, how long do you plan to stay with us? That obviously depends on how things go whether I'm suited to the firm and the firm to me. Tell me about some of your recent goals and what you do to achieve them. I want to put my knowledge and experience to use in a challenging position. In order to achieve this goal, I just want to work step by step. What is your long-range objective? I haven't thought it over at all. What do you think is the most important thing when looking for a job? I think the most important thing is the interest in the job. This is Mary. I just want to let you know that we made an offer to you. The salary is 3,000 yuan a month. I emailed the offer to you as well. You can let me know within a week if you accept the offer. Thank you. I'll go through it and tell you. We hope you get on board with us. Please let me know as soon as possible. I will. Thank you for all. How much are you asking for this? I'm offering them to you at 150 yuan a piece. Is that all right? Is tax already included in their price? Yes. Our price can't be matched. Would you consider a volume discount? If you buy 1,000 or more, you'll get a 10% discount. I'll accept your offer. Well, we've settled everything in connection with this transaction except the question of the mode of payment. Because this order is a comparatively big one, we would like to pay by time L, C, say, 60 days L, C. Payment by site L, C is quite usual in international trade, and as a rule, we only accept payment by site L, C. But we have only moderate mean at hand. If you can do us a special favor this time and allow us to delay payment, we'd really appreciate it. Accepting time L, C is unusual and I've never done it before, but we could consider your request. I'll phone our company to see what they say. Thank you for your consideration. When will you let me know your answer? This afternoon. I heard that Ed has special services to help me get a job. Callus is a great internet-based placement service that is available to you. I don't have access to a computer. There is an area at the Ed Center that is set up with computers for you to make use of. Is there anything else at the Ed offices to help me with my job search? We can provide you with information that will help you understand what is available. We also provide workshops. If I go to Ed in person, what type of workshops might I find there? 
Our two most important workshops are resume writing and interviewing. What are some other places where I might look for work? Job fairs are popular places to look for work. MRC Rabi. I'm pleased to see you. I've looked over your resume, Ms. Jane. I see you've already have quite a lot of experience in secretary work. Could you tell me something about your talent with that company? Oh, yes. I worked there for two years. Just graduated from college. And? It was a good company to work for. I enjoyed my time with them. Do you like that work? Yes, I like it very much. The work was not very demanding, and the people I work with were friendly. Why do you want to leave the company? Because it is an age of challenges. I must accept the new challenge in my life. Jane, we are going to have a board meeting next Friday. Will you please arrange it for me? Certainly, Mr. Robert. But can I have your plan? Sure. Actually, it's a routine board meeting. The things to be discussed are all written here. Very good. May I keep it? I need it to draw up a notice of the meeting and the agenda. Go ahead. It's for your reference. While you are at it, Make me a special agenda and don't forget to have enough room at the side for notes. You mean you need a more detailed agenda for yourself? Exactly. As I am supposed to the chair of the meeting, I don't want it to get out of control. I see. Okay. Then where do you think we will have the meeting? The conference room on the second floor. Is that okay? Yes, I will see that the room is ready by Friday. And I will check there are enough chairs, and the lighting and air conditioning are all right. Good. And please get some water, glasses and ashtray ready as well. Sure, I will. What about the minutes? Do you think I am responsible for that too? Definitely. The minutes have to be taken accurately. But I am not familiar with the members of the board. Oh, that's easy. I will write you a list of their names. You can make a seating plan with the names and give each one a number. That's a good idea. All right, I'll withdraw and get down to it if you don't mind. Are you introverted or extroverted? I wouldn't call myself introverted. Sometimes I enjoy being by myself very much. But other times I like sharing activities with others too. What kind of personality do you think you have? Well, I approach things very enthusiastically, I think, and I don't like to leave something half done. It makes me nervous. I can't concentrate on something else until the first thing is finished. What do you think is the most important thing for you to be happy? For me, this would be having good relationships with my family members. My family has always been very close-knit, and we still spend a lot of time together. What basic principles do you apply to your life? Working hard and being frugal are both virtues. I strive to practice these two virtues in my life. Hi, Sven, can you help me? Could you hold the end of the tape measure, please? Of course. Where do you want me to stand? Just there by the door. I need to measure the length of this workbench. We're going to replace it. Okay, 3 meters 47 centimeters. Let's round it up to 3 meters 50. I'm glad you're replacing it. We need more space to work on things. How deep will the new workbench be? Tell me what size you want and I'll order the wood. Well, it's about 65 centimeters at the moment. 
Could we increase it by about a third? Sure. So let's see. We need a piece of wood 3.5 meters long by 1 meter wide. I'll order it right away and I'll be able to install it next Tuesday. Did you have any working experience during college? Yes, I did some part-time jobs such as English tutor, salesman, and model. What did you learn from your part-time jobs? I learned to be patient, professional and gained a LL of experience of direct sales. What is your strongest trait? Adaptability and sense of humor. How would your friends or colleagues describe you? Pause a few seconds. They say Mr. Chen is an honest, hardworking and responsible man who deeply cares for his family and friends. What personality traits do you admire? Honest, flexible and easygoing. What leadership qualities did you develop as an administrative personnel? I feel that learning how to motivate people and to work together as a team will be the major goal of my leadership. How do you normally handle criticism? Silence is golden. Just don't say anything. Otherwise the situation could become worse. I do, however, accept constructive criticism. What do you find frustrating in a work situation? Sometimes, the narrow-minded people make me frustrated. How do you handle your conflict with your colleagues in your work? I will try to present my ideas in a more clear and civilized manner in order to get my points across. To secure employment hopefully with your company. How long would you like to stay with this company? I will stay as long as I can continue to learn and to grow in my field. What did you exactly do there? I was responsible for helping patients restore their organic functions, training them in speech and organism, carrying our massage and physiotherapy, taking care of patients' nutrition and diet. What do you think are the qualifications for being a doctor? They are sense of post, mentality quality, first aid ability, emergency adjustment, and law consciousness. Our factory locates at a village in the east of the city. The area of it is 3,600 square meters. We'd like to visit the factory. Can you show me the way? That's okay. We'll take you to have a tour. Please follow me. How many shifts are there in your factory? There are two shifts now in total. What about your company's QC management? We established the strict QC standards and we have followed it for about five years with good results. Where are the workers from? From the villages nearby? Most of them live in the city. We provide free commuter buses for the workers. Besides, we built the dormitory building for the workers on night shift. It sounds nice. We can't wait to visiting the factory. Hi. Have you got the exact number of people who are going take part in this activity? Yes, there are 62 in totals, and two of them still can't be sure. They always push the time. How many of them are over 50? Six. So we should give them special attention. Some of them don't have a good health. Okay, I see. As far as you think, how many buses should we get for them? Two should be enough. For each one has at least 30 seats. There will be some seats to spare. I'll call the bus charter later. And have you announced the itinerary of this journey to all of them? 
Yes, most of them think it's good. But, some people have different opinions. They consider we should arrange some challenging activities. That's possible. At that time, they can choose any activity they like. That's good. I'll tell them later. And what kind of medicine we should be prepared? Let me think. Pills for car sick, traditional medicine for cold, some painkillers and something like that. Okay. We should get them ready this afternoon. One more thing. Have you got all people's phone numbers? Oh, God. I've almost forgotten. I'll get it done right away. The operation in the lab is radioactive and dangerous, so work with care. Have you got ear muffs and gloves? Do I have to wear ear muffs and gloves? I am not used to working with them on. Yes, you have to. It is a safety rule of the company. You could not only lose your job but your hearing if you don't. Okay, I'll go and get a pair of them. Hello, this is Lucy from ABC Company. Is this Monica? Yes. I am calling to inform you that you have passed the first two rounds of interview. Could you please come for the final round? It is scheduled on the morning of next Monday 10 a.m. in the HR manager office. Thank you for calling me. I will be there on time. Okay. See you then. Bye. Bye. May I speak to Mr. Smith? He is at the warehouse this morning. What time do you expect him back? Sorry, I have no idea. You can call him there if you like. Okay, I have the number. Bye. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to become a part of our growing YouTube community and to learn English effectively.